Hi, my Geminis. It's Jamie Zebra 23. I am doing a love spread for September 13th to September 23rd, 2017 for Gemini Sun, Moon, and Rising. I'm on all social media. It's Jamie Zebra 23. If you'd like a personal reading, check out my website, jamiezebra23.com. My readings are $25, $50, and $75. I typically do your readings within 24 to 72 hours. I also have a new feature, same day readings. It's a little pricier, but you get your readings the same day. I also have a $5 one question, one answer via email only. So this is your love spread for Gemini Sun, Moon, and Rising. You have the Seven of Wands. You got the two of swords and then you got the four of pentacles. So right off the bat, guys, there is a Capricorn, a Taurus, or a Virgo person that wants to hold on to you. They're holding on to you tightly. And then for others of you, there is a, um, a Capricorn, Taurus, or a Virgo, a Gemini, a fellow Gemini, a Libra, or an Aquarius person that wants to kind of keep you around because they think that you're financially stable or they feel like you will be in the near future or they feel like um, you will be a fallback for them financially and that's why they want to keep you around. So keep that in mind. This will be revealed to you around the, the end of this. So keep that in mind. And then with the two of swords here, there is a a Gemini, a Libra, or an Aquarius person that's making a decision. Um, they don't know if they want another air sign, a Capricorn, or a uh, water sign. Um, a Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, Capricorn, Taurus, or Virgo. They're not sure who they want. Um, they're kind of playing the field. I feel like this person has three people. This could be you or this could be the other party. There's three people involved. And then for those of you that are dealing with fire, Sagittarius, Leo, or Aries, Capricorn, Taurus, or Virgo, you may be able to get over an issue in the, in the next 10 days. Um, this issue with this person, because this is overwhelming odds surmounted. It's like everything is stacked against you. The odds are stacked against your relationship. Um, the odds are stacked against you getting into a relationship, being able to find love. This could be through witchcraft. This could be just through, through uh, energetic blocks that you put on yourself or from past lives. Or this could just be... You know, your life is kind of fucked up and it's hard to find love. But it, Or their life is kind of fucked up. They could have drug habits or there could be all sorts of issues here. For each of you, it's a different thing. But um, it's saying overwhelming odds surmounted. You know, you may have robbed somebody and this person's like, okay, I'm, I still love you. I'll take you back. Or they, they could have robbed you or somebody's treated you like shit and you're willing to take them back. Or you've treated somebody really, really badly and the impossible is happening. They're saying, I don't care. I still love you when they should be running. Yeah. Um, and then also with these two cards together, it's like somebody gives you a chance and then you screw them over again. Or you give somebody a chance and then they screw you over again. So keep that in mind. And also, um, a lot, like I said, a lot of you are going to find out that this whole situation is motivated by money. By, um, by either money or by assistance. Somebody's getting some help. Either they need a roof over their head. You know, they, need, they either need you to fund them, feed them, or blank them. That's what this is about. All right, guys. Ta-ta for now.